everyone so it's time for another one page at a time video <laughs> not really much else to say I'm just gonna go ahead and jump on into all the pages that I did from this past week okay so the first page that I started out on for the new week was send a text to that new person you met last night don't be nervous and then it had a cell phone and basically you just wrote what you were going to text the person um, I'm kind of like a homebody or an introvert and I don't really go out and so I didn't meet anybody the night before and I went to the library the next day and I actually met two new people there which were librarians I kind of cheated because I did it the, the following day but like they were the closest to new people that I had met so I went ahead and did it that way anyways so I just put hey librarian thanks for telling me I had pretty handwriting never heard that but it's nice and then also to the librarian in the children's section, thanks for not thinking I'm weird for checking out a kid's book. And then it has like another one to where you can like respond from the other person's point of view. And I put, you are weird, lol. I didn't really know what else to put. Like I, I really don't go anywhere. I don't really meet new people that often. So I try to improvise and do what I could. I hope that that's okay. But yeah, then I colored the phone and that's all I did on it. But check out a kid's book but it's not really like a kid's book it's kind of like a preteen like starting teenagers kind of book it's not really like just made for like little kids in particular I'm just gonna shut up now so then the following page was go off the grid decided to do this little idea of writing the ABC's like over and over again and putting a quote within the ABC's and I made like the regular alphabet black and then I made like the quote in different colors and I put if plan A doesn't work out remember there are 25 other letters in the alphabet stay cool and I really like that quote because like I said in my last video like this I struggle all the time um, with my New Year's resolution I have been since the beginning of the new year and quotes like this really help lift my spirit and keep me motivated and help me to stay strong and just keep pushing on, keep pushing towards that New Year's resolution. And then on the next page it said fill out your sick day checklist and it already had lots of drinks, tissues, vitamin C, and a little sympathy so I just wrote a walking dead slash horror marathon of course, a good book, best friends, a warm bubble bath, a fuzzy blanket or pajamas, a good smelling candle, kitty snuggles, and YouTube videos. So that's pretty much all I did on that page was just make a little list for whenever I get sick. It's nice to have something like that too for like whenever you actually get sick you can just look back in the book and find it. So the next page was kind of funny and it was an ads page so I took it as you were supposed to write or draw your own little ads and I decided to make this really funny do not take this seriously because it was all just for fun this one was supposed to be kind of like proactive or like one of those like acne medication um, commercials infomercials and it says ready to get the skin you've always wanted even with two zit style 1-800 fast act and I just thought that would be really funny <laughs> Um, so I put like a guy's before picture with like two zits and then his after picture and he has no zits at all. And then directly underneath that I just have like a hoochie looking mama and I put hot lonely horny woman who could be a guy 1-800 I'm a man. And like I said don't take this seriously it was just for fun I thought it would be funny to add like my own little ads in here like that. And then right beside that I put new weight loss supp supplement click here. And then Viagra, congrats, you just won an iPad. Quick, your computer has a virus, pay 89000 to rid. And then I put download now. I want to give your computer a virus. So yeah, I just filled this entire page in with my own little funny ads. So yeah, like I said, all for fun, just jokes. I wasn't being serious whenever I wrote them, obviously.
following page after that just said, did you do that sick day checklist page? Maybe it's just me, but I feel a little tickle in my throat. Better safe than sorry. So I just drew everything that I wrote down on that page. Um, I have a TV with The Walking Dead. Um, I have two horror movies right here, which are The, the Ring and The Grudge and a remote. Um, I have a kitty that's like all lovey-dovey and it says purr purr. There's my fuzzy blanket. Um, YouTube videos on my iPod. There's my drinks. Um, here's some tissues, some fuzzy pajamas, some vitamins. A candle, a phone with my best friend on, um, a bubble bath, TLC, tender loving care, and a good book. So yeah, that's all I did on that page. I just thought it would be cute. Then the following page says, write a letter to your mom. And then I put, dear mom, thank you for never giving up on me and for loving me unconditionally. Even when I wasn't the easiest to love. Thank you for keeping a roof over my head, feeding me, making sure I'm well taken care of. Thank you for always telling me what's on your mind, even if I don't always like it. I love you. So then I just collared it and then put a bunch of hearts around it and that's all I did on that page. I kept it simple, but I really like it because it's meaningful to me and it speaks the truth. page and the page that I did yesterday was write yourself a secret motivation and fold this page up tight. I don't think that you're supposed to read the motivation to anyone because it's supposed to be a secret but I'm gonna go ahead and do that with you guys anyways because you guys are my friends and you guys can keep my secret right? Psst. Hey you stop beating yourself up over what you can't change. Hang in there. You're doing your very best. Eventually your your hard work and pain will pay off. You do this for you. Love me. Um, so I just wrote that in a marker and then I folded it up like so. And yeah, now nobody can see my secret motivation. that I did in my one page at a time this past week. Please leave me a comment and let me know what your favorite page was out of my one page at a time. Mine definitely has to be the ads page and probably the sick the sick day checklist page where he said to go back or whatever because I really liked that one. But yeah let me know what yours were and also give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you haven't already and become a morbid maniac. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! <laughs>